Hey guys, I'm back and as you can tell by the title, I am going from couponing to um I'm not even glam, so I'm not even gonna call it glam. I don't even know. From couponing to makeup, face beat, I don't know. But anyways, I watch another couponer, um, Miss Netta, and I saw her doing a makeup video and it was so funny. Um she was I know she was trying to think of a um Mac eyeshadow and I was like I have that eyeshadow so I know exactly what she's talking about anyways um she is wanting to learn how to do her makeup and let's face it your girl here does not get glammed up um I just real every day I just don't have time for it and it's like impossible for me to wake up and get up an extra hour early just to do my makeup no not gonna happen so um I commented on one of, I'm um, sorry, I commented on her video and told her if um, she wanted me to show her how I do mine, and it is definitely 20 minutes or less. So, she said, of course, so we are, I guess, kind of collabing on doing a little makeup video. Um, Miss Netta, this is for you. So... First off, I know I have a lot of different products than you. You have a lot of um, store brand, which I do use a L'Oreal um, True Match um, because I am out of my NC45 for MAC. And I would go and buy it, but I haven't went back to MAC. I need to go, but I'm waiting until I have six of these that are empty because when you have six empty containers from MAC, you get a free lipstick. Even though I hardly wear lipstick, but I am just going to wait and then go all at once. And plus, I passed by there when I went to Macy's the other day and like the makeup counter at MAC is ridiculous during the holidays. So, no. Alright, so everything that I have is pretty much MAC. I have a lot of MAC. I have Urban Decay. Um, I will say, Netta, if you want some gold to definitely invest in this. This was a gift for me. It's the Naked 3 palette. And it's funny, but I have never, ever used it. Look how pretty that is. It's all gold and neutral colors. Pretty much. And you will love it. Let me just show you again. Okay. It is fabulous. And it comes with the brushes. So, a lot of makeup uh, YouTubers, they have this palette. And two, I think it costs around $50, which is not bad. It'll last you. And it also comes with the eyelid primer. I haven't used it, but there it is right there. And I, let's go. Okay. So, we're at 3 minutes and 40 seconds of me talking. I'm going to do this in less than 20. Definitely. So, first of all, this is my makeup or eyelid, eyeshadow palette. And I have a lot of these. This is lasting me, I will tell you, for about two years. Because I'm telling you, I don't wear it all the time. And the gold color right here, this is the woodwink right there. The gold woodwink. I think that's what you were talking about. But, um, I like it. But, you can pop these out. And this is the gold. Hopefully, when I put it on, it'll show better. But it's really gloomy here in Texas. So it's um, it's just like bad lighting in my house. So I would suggest do six of these if you want this for MAC. Because you can pop these out. This is a 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18? Yeah, 6, no, 15. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This is a 15... Um, eyeshadow palette right here and I've had it for a while um, so as you can tell the main four colors I use are this one this one this one and that one and I will tell you this so invest in one of these it will last you forever in a day because mine has so let's go okay so prep and prime this is natural radiance base it is from Mac let's prep in the mornings, if I was doing this, it would be like super fast. And I wore makeup yesterday. And I tried to wipe all of it off really good before I would do this. But I can still see that I have some mascara under here. But it's okay because I have dark circles anyways. So 
and I think I said this before in another video that my husband calls me raccoon eyes. Isn't he so mean? No, I'm joking. He really did, does call me that, but it's just a joke. He's really sweet. All right, so next up, um, because of my dark circles, I just like to put some L'Oreal True Match Concealer under there. And this is the Do You Boo. Whatever works best for you. Now, I have um, a lot of MAC brushes. I think this is a 188 or 168, but it's not a concealer brush, it's a foundation brush, but I'm just gonna use it because it's right there. Just to blend out my circles, girl. All right. Next up will be, do you see how I just throw that down there? Because that's how it is for me. It's going to be my L'Oreal True Match. I do swear by this. I really do like this. Um, I've been using it for a while now. And I just pour some in the lid. And let's apply. Now, I know a lot of people like go down further and all of this. Not me. I ain't got time for all that. And plus, usually when I go to work, I don't wear a shirt like this. All my shirts are like collared shirts, collared polo shirts for work. Unless it's cold and then I wear a sweater. And I do have a blender, a beauty blender, but I like this brush I like all my MAC brushes. I would say invest in them because they will last you forever. You know that saying, you get what you pay for, it's really true. And I'm the cheapest person alive, no joke. The only thing I like to spend money on is purses. but. These brushes will last, I'm telling you. And I am fortunate that my neighbor, she moved. She worked at MAC. So, look at that. I got a lot of MAC stuff on the Lolo. But even before I met her, before she moved, I still had Mac, but then she's the one who helped me learn how to do my makeup. And ever since then, what she taught me is what I do, and that's how I roll with it. But sometimes I will play with it. Like when I'm at, it's weird. Whenever I have a surgery, because I've had surgeries on my knees, on um, one of my knees three times, that is when I get so bored because I can't sleep, and I will like play and make up. All right, so here we go. Just put my foundation. That took a while, but I blended it out a lot. Next up, these three eyeshadow brushes are life. Now, normally I would do my brows, but my brows aren't waxed, so I'm not even gonna do them. I might fill them in just a little bit, but it's gonna be after I do my, why am I talking to the viewfinder? It's gonna be after I do my, um, lids or eyeshadow but that it's just your preference so what I always do first is let me pick up this color right here this is oh god sketch I don't know why I didn't know that I use it every day sketch I don't think you can really see it that good it's kind of like a burgundy purplish goldy with the shimmer Sketch is what I use in the crease. I swear by this 
makeup routine every single time. Now, I did use like a purple when I had some make makeup on in my video yesterday when someone noticed them, I did my makeup. Um, but I'm not like a pop person, like make it pop. I'm like really, really neutral. I like other people when they make it pop, but not me. All right, so probably, I don't know. Let me close my eyes. Okay, so I got Sketch in my crease. Now, what I do with this brush, which is a 217, this brush right here, this brush right here. I'm not even lying. I'm not even a makeup person, but this brush is life. So next up, I'm going to take Trax, T-R-A-X, and you can tell that Trax is right here. I use it all the time, and I'm hoping that it just lasts me a little bit longer. Trax is going to go at the top on the outer part right here. And it has a shimmer and it kind of just like makes it pop and you should probably have two of these brushes because this is a good blending brush in my opinion I'm not a makeup person so I'm gonna like take a step back so y'all can see it this light right here I don't know but yeah Bam, drop that brush. And then this brush right here, I don't even know the number. It's two, I wanna say it's a 230, but this is the lid brush. It's similar to like the Urban Decay. If you just did the Urban Decay. Look, it's still in the freaking paper. I have never used it. So, lid brush and then there's the other part of it. I would recommend it. All right, so on my lids, I'm gonna use all that glitters. It's like a gold too. And I'm not an eyeliner person. It just doesn't happen. I don't understand how people can do the wing liners. I was blessed with the talent of technology. I'm really good with computers and electronics and software and things like that. You're not gonna catch me being that coordinated to be able to do a wing liner because I can't do it. I tried. I can't even put on lashes. I tried that too. It just did not happen. All right, so see that? Can you see? So this part right here is if you had another 217 brush, you blend. That's it, just blend. In my opinion, this works for me. So that the eyeshadow is just not sitting on top of the lid. And then I'm going to grab a tissue. And then I'm going to just grab a little bit of wood wink and just go at the top. And the wood wink is the gold. And go back over and blend it again. And like I said, my brows are not done I can't really do my eyebrows unless they're like perfectly arched and waxed and mine aren't right now 
and so I've been doing this for about 10 minutes stopping and talking and here we go so I like to put um, in what is this that's not it that's not what I wanted the Mac the powder I like to use it a lot of people I don't see them doing foundation in the studio fix but me I prefer to do that I'm oily so I can't just put foundation in my opinion I just feel like it's not enough And to me, if I make my eyes pop, that's all that matters. Um, normally, I would do um, like bronzer and like contouring, but realistically, I don't have time for that in the mornings. I just don't. Um, I have this one by e.l.f. I really like it, but I don't know where it is, so I don't have it right now. Um, so the mascara that i am currently using is by charlotte tilbury it's just a black mascara i live by this right now i love it and let's see i can take forever doing my lashes because to me if your mascara is done so good that's all that matters Make those eyes pop, and it's all good. Now, I have long eyelashes, so I can't even see myself even attempt. I tried to put on fake lashes once because I just was curious about it. I had glue everywhere. It was a hot mess express. Isn't it weird how everybody that puts mascara you have to go this? What is up with that? I'm just about done and this was less than 20 minutes I did talk a first what few minutes but less than 20 minute makeup Is just wipe off. This is just a olive ole. I don't know why I say olive ole. Ole little wipes. I probably got them for free. But I use those just to go in and like fix anything that's looking crazy. And uh, I will say I'm not really a lipstick person. I'm a glosser. So y'all know I swear by my Nivea lip balm all day, every day. Now, if I were going to do my brows, that will take forever in a day. And I have just any eyebrow pencil you want. Just. video helped you out and show you how I
I do my makeup in the mornings um, an everyday look for me and I hope that woodwink gold color was what you were um, talking about again I will show you hopefully ah you can see it it is right here um and that's about it if you guys are interested in watching miss netta's videos she's also an awesome couponer and we also live in different states so she has stores that i don't have here i know for sure she has a rite aid i'm not sure about the grocery stores but um i will link her channel in the bottom if you guys want to head over and check her videos out and give them a thumbs up i will see you guys later in my next video i will be doing cvs upcoming deals starting later this week um, i'm gonna come back with that video today don't forget if you have not commented on the printer giveaway video do that because i will close out that video tonight at midnight so everybody get those comments in before midnight um i will come back and announce the winner either tomorrow or thursday thursday is christmas eve um i have some doctor's appointments tomorrow so i'm not sure if i'm going to be able to film but i will try um other than that guys happy holidays thank you so much for watching and supporting my channel i appreciate it i love you guys you are awesome and i will see you later don't forget to go over and check out miss netta bye